Hello everyone and welcome back to Fire Emblem Three Hopes at Azure Gleam episode. We got some supports and then we're just gonna dive right into the mission. <sighs> that should be everything in its place now. And high time we took a break, if you ask me. Lugging all those boxes was hard work. Hey, why don't you join me for a meal? Might be nice to head into town for once. Mm, I'm not that hungry just yet, though. Oh, I've got it. If you'd like, we could have a tea party. I have a cache of delicious treats we can eat as well. Sure, I guess I could go for some tea. Where'd that idea come from, though? Well... I received some sugar recently as a gift from one of the soldiers I mended back to hell. I used it to bake the most wonderful confections. I'd love for you to try them. Huh, that does sound good. And a little something sweet once in a while never hurt anyone. Then we're settled. Give me just a moment, I'll get everything ready. Whoa, these are incredible. I've never had anything quite like them before. <laughs> I'm glad to hear it. I'm particularly happy with how those turned out. It does actually taste kind of familiar, though. Almost like this snack my mom used to make. Really? You don't say. Yeah. I was raised in this little village off in the mountains, absolutely surrounded by nature. Sometimes mom would go out and gather fruit from the trees, then bake things with them. Mmm, there's nothing better than a dessert made with fresh fruit. I love them myself. You can knead them into dough and bake them, or preserve them in honey so they can be enjoyed the whole year round. My mom's stuff was never quite as fancy as the things you make, but they were special in their own way. And even though we didn't have them too often, just one hint of that flavor and it's like I'm a kid again. Guess they were just that good. It's wonderful you have that memory to look back on. I can tell the time you spent with your mother was very precious to you. For sure. Though I don't remember it too well anymore. Can I ask you something? Do you ever wish you could return to the past? To those days with your mother? It would be great to go back if I could, yeah. We'd have so much more to talk about now that I'm older. But the past is the past. My mom is gone, and there's nothing I can do to change that. Yes. Yes, I suppose you're right. Hey, what's wrong? Was it something I said? Hmm? Oh, my apologies. I must have been daydreaming for a moment there. Here, try this one next. I made it specially to pair with the tea. Uh, sure. Thanks. Yeah, it definitely sounds like she's still thinking about her brother. Yeah, and then I believe we have to do an Ash next, so... Oh, it's so late. I didn't mean to take this much of a detour. Just getting back? Hey, Dudu. Hope I didn't worry you. You didn't. You were in town, yes? I went to pick up some supplies. But on the way back, I saw these flowers blooming, and I just couldn't help but pick some. Ah, uh, yarrows. They're used as an ingredient in healing salves. Although you can also slap the leaves on your wounds and get mostly the same effect. Oh, and I plan on soaking them in alcohol. It'll produce a liquid that can be used for a wonderful ointment. Yeah, though, I suppose it would be faster to just use healing magic. You seem well informed on the subject. 
Lenato knew all about it. So, I picked up a few things from him. Lord Lenato had an interest in plants? Oh, sure. He kept tons of botanical encyclopedias and books like that in his room. He loved flowers. He even kept a small herb garden at Castle Gaspar. Hey, you like gardening too, right? I mean, you were always watering the flowers in the greenhouse back at Garrett Mock. I suppose I do, though I know little of the medicinal properties. Yeah, I guess knowing how to grow plants is different from knowing how to use them. Even so, the greenhouse was a treasure to me. You're right about that. I found flowers there I'd never even seen in Castle Gaspar's garden. I would like very much to visit this garden of yours one day. We should go! Of course, a lot has happened since I last saw it. But my younger siblings should still be looking after it. I look forward to it. Though, how did Lord Lenato come to know so much about medicinal herbs? Uh, he used to serve Grand Duke Rufus, so... Maybe he studied them while he was in the capital. Perhaps. <sighs> Sorry. <laughs> I'm just sitting here chatting away when I should be off making myself useful. Of course. Medicinal herbs. Hmm. That was interesting. I am kind of glad that, you know, they talked more about their whole thing with plants, because, like, I don't, their supports before that was all about, well not all about, but I know their supports before involved a bit about cooking and other things as well. Alrighty, it is now time to add to the war map. Assault on Arundel territory. The Ashen Demons working with the enemy? You're sure? If my reports are anything to go by, yes. Hmm, yay! And as this demon is the one who slew your old company? I would like you to handle the matter. You know, wait, no, this is Dimitri. He's all about revenge. Never mind! Nothing would make me happier, honest. But you shouldn't change your strategy for my sake. Just focus on winning the battle. That's it. Yet I know this is what drives you. I want to do everything yeah, in my Dimitri. power to help you achieve it. It's like, if I can't achieve my... Re or like, if I... I want to make sure other people get their own revenge. Well, I can't argue with that, but this little rivalry isn't worth losing a war over. Is that all it is to you? A rivalry? I must admit, I've been meaning to ask. Do you not bear hatred for the person who murdered your friends? Oh! Not really. Death kinda just comes with the territory when you're a merc. And your friends one day can just as easily become your targets the next. Now, not getting my money or having a client betray me, yeah, that'll get me upset. But I can't go around seeking vengeance for every last fallen ally. It would consume my whole life. <coughs> Maybe take that lesson to heart, Dimitri. <laughs> Just That's saying. So. I'm sure you can relate, as a king and all. There's only so much burden one person can carry. Or maybe you can't relate. If you'll forgive me for saying so, I think you've been letting things weigh on you too much. <laughs> Be that as it may, your words just now have given me an idea. Please forget I ever mentioned this if you find it disagreeable, but... What do you think about inviting those mercenaries onto our side? <laughs> Perhaps not in the immediate future, but once their allegiance is not so concrete... Have them join us? 
I don't know. Loyalty is an important concern in the mercenary business, I understand. But if we were to provide greater pay than the Empire... Don't worry, Dimitri. I'll eventually come around to the Ashen Demon. Rodrigue wishes to see you, Your Majesty. He has questions about our formation. Thank you, Vidu. If you'll excuse me, I must attend to this. We can speak more later. Hand in hand with the very people you've been hunting, hmm? This king of ours sure has some funny ideas. Defeat Hector. The Death Knight? We're fighting him? Either of your group of mutants routed. Um. To protect an important strong old. Oh. Yeah, I want to persuade Bernadetta. I don't feel a need for healing. Attack. I guess we'll go group ice. To protect an important stronghold. That sound. It's like we. Honestly, we might need it. Yeah, because. Honestly, I don't really care about those three, so. I mean, I might have chosen something different if I don't want to quote Bernadetta, but I do, so. Where? Okay. I guess the question really becomes, where's the depth? I do want to make sure Mercy's here. I'm just gonna hit remove all the units real quick. With the exception of, of course, Dimitri. Oh wait, hang on, I'm seeing him. Oh! Wait. I do think we are going to meet Felix. Oh, or I think it's Petra. I don't know, I'm kind of thinking Felix. Fail. Oh, is he gonna be, he's good against the Death Knight, right? Okay, never mind then. I'm assuming Gerald's gotta show up here too, so. And I fish. When, when are they gonna give us Cyril? Oh, cause the only reason why Sadith is being a Lance unit. Oh wow. Sadith, you're joining us. Yeah, the only reason why I have I won't fail. Have said if as the Lance unit is because of the Spear of a Soul. Or the Soul, because he's like really good with that. Oh wait, hang on. Uh yeah, let's grab a net. Hmm, they're not uh, I don't yeah, I don't know who I'm gonna bring a net over here. I won't let you down. I guess I should bring Felix over here. Right, 
is, yeah, the blue. They want someone over there. Um. Yeah, who? Ash is not. I was saying, Ash is higher level, but no one is good against him. He has no, like, enemy weaknesses right now. Guess let's just bring up, like... Well, I kind of want... Yeah. Because I mainly want... I mainly want Flame to be able to heal someone and keep these two groups together. I think that's what I'm gonna do. Not settings. Save. We shall repel the Imperial Army here and put a halt to their invasion. But be wary. They possess no small supply of skilled warriors. From the looks of it, they've gone and camped out in the ruins of that village. Keep your guard hard. These mercenaries could be waiting behind any corner. Yeah. For now, though, let us deal with the foes we can see. Okay. Let's begin. It's time to move. I'll do what I can. Science adjutant. Oh, ooh, it's playing. I will assist you. Oh, what's it called? Indominal Bull Will? No. War of Dominion. Proceed as planned. We must strive to perform, shall we? We must press onward. No way. Send an order. Shall we? I am on my way. Shall we? There we go. Let's give it a shot. Hi, Death Knight. Okay. It's time to move. The I'm road going. to the village is blocked up. We'll need to find another way. Come on. X. Oh, I should have saved that. Oh, well. Oh, who just leveled up? Annette! I'm not stopping now. Good. How many remain? Allow me. The ash <gasps> on the enemy's ranks, your majesty, as well as the death knight, the empire's most fearsome general. We should try to keep them both isolated if we can. Enemies! Oh, they're coming to get us! Everyone, defend for yourselves! Okay, well then. I'm assuming they want to seize the stronghold, so. We will proceed as planned. We must strive to perform to the best of our ability. Yeah, I definitely want Mercedes to encounter the Death Knight, so. Let's begin. It's time to move. Not a problem. 
I've got this. Nice of them to open the doors for us. Now let's take control. Are you Yep. That's for us, Sam. Grant them no mercy. And then X. Shall we? And then, yeah, let's come and start going shot. for that one. That's two down. We're doing it. There we go. There we go. X. Oh, there we go. Indeed. I love how they're just willing to let me come through. Are you ready? No, no, they're not. The Ashen Demon and the Death Knight can't be as scary as they sound, right? Right. Oh, wait, we have one more. Um Dimitri, are you we no. will proceed as planned. Not a problem. I've got this. I've got Control. This. Take a breather. Dimitri, don't you dare go to Yep. I'm getting stronger. Indeed. You know what? I think it's fine that we didn't bring Ash. He's way over leveled. Cause I think he was level 18. There we go. Okay. Nice. We'll do it together. I got you now. Okay, we got those strongholds. First, the chest. The stronghold will likely prove the key to our victory on this. Oh no! We the... must keep it. Who has the? The P conditions have changed. Don't let the connecting strong help us. just be exciting after all. I'm coming too. We can't let them keep pushing us around. <laughs> oh, this is so interesting. We will proceed as planned. We must strive to perform to the best of our ability. Shall we? Let's give it a shot. Not a problem. Defend. I'm here to help. And to do Let's begin. Defend. I will be your shield. Yeah. Control. I must strong. I've awaited this moment. So they've come. Keep your distance for now. We must focus our efforts on the remaining Imperial encampments. Oh, okay. You dare stand against me. At least try to make it interesting then. It's my true Do not power. throw yourself at that wall, Jedi. Time isn't right for it. Yeah, about that. Oh, I was like, don't throw yourself at them yet, me. So absolutely destroy them. Shall 
shall we? Let's give it a shot. Let's give it a shot. Allow me. A long range now, please. I need assistance. Strike in unison. Yep. You can leave this to me. This is it. <gasps> Did I get rid of the Death Knight? No. A rematch then. Good. Shall we? Let's give it a shot. My turn. Guard this place with your lives. I've no with this moment. Earth Splitter. Come on. I just really wanted to beat. Restoratives in order. Hey. No stopping us. You're finished. Yes, understood. Stand down. <gasps> yes. I did it. I what do you mean you did it? it? Do be sure not to let your guard down. What do you mean you did it? Dimitri's the one that defeated! Not bad, but I'm not done yet. Rally! Do not throw yourself at that wall just yet. Okay, yeah, uh, just run. We move now. Oh wait, hang on. No, no, no. You're weak to axes. Um. Not a problem. I've got this. Shadow slide. Well, couldn't hurt. Not a problem. I've got this. Oh, uh, control Let's her. Oh wait, no. We're already. Never mind. Take a break. It isn't right for it. Okay, fine. Wait. There's a key. Shall we? Take out that person with the key, please. Let's Thank you. Shot. That's one catapult dealt with. Let's move on to the other. Oh, I bet I have the catapult then. Yeah, we'll come and I'll take you all on. A? We are better together. We'll do it together. Yes, we will. Now that I think of it, these catapults may be of use to us. Oh, they got our catapults! Which means they're coming for us next! Run away! Yep, um... Sorry, Bernie. Shall we? Let's give it a shot. Let's give it a shot. <laughs> oh! Dear. Um... Dimitri, you play. need to defend. I will move to assist. I can go. She's their leader. As much as it hurts to say it, we cannot let her leave here alive. Defeat Bernadetta! That soldier looks rather panicked. She may be convinced to join us with a bit of pressure. <laughs> Great, okay. Oh 
I'm gonna say, I'm so... No, Bernie. Bernie! Bernie, 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 Bernie. There we go. Wait, I just realized we have another archer. Why won't you just let me go? Because I can't, Bernie. I'm sorry. Surrender. We don't want to have to kill you, Bernadetta. Please. Wait, what? No, I'm not ready to die. Please, don't murder me. Right, and then. Not a problem. Move out. How do I activate that little thing? The Ashen Demon and the Death Knight are the only major threats remaining. I make for the central stronghold. My prey awaits. Fine. I'll handle the strongholds on the perimeter then. <laughs> Let's begin. Wait. It's Fountain sees that. Did he reclaim it? Oh, well, either Shall way, we? defend. I'll provide assistance. We will proceed as planned. We must strive to perform to the best of our ability. Control. Time, I'm going. All units, clear out of the central stronghold. We aim to ensnare the Death Knight. Okay. Shall we? Come with me, everyone. If that's the plan. Like next. Now, close the gates. Sever his escape route. Okay. Where is Gerald out of curiosity? from the northwestern stronghold. Oh. Okay. I shall take the lead. Here I go. Google it alone. No! We got the other reinforcements. We can't let them seize the central stronghold. Okay. Not a problem. I've got this. Us an adjutant. We need Yeah, we need another sword user to deal with the brigands. Let's begin. It's time to deal with Gerald. Yeah, and then Sadith can deal with those people as well, so... We have armored units at our disposal 
as well. They can bolster any stronghold in need of the assistance. Yes. Wait. Oh! I had plane. I will give it my all. Well. I shall do my part. I thought I gave Dimitri that. Um, sorry. Shall we? I must succeed. Shall we? Let's give it Oh a no. No, no, no. Rescind order. Shall we? Let's give it a shot. I've got this. Take a breather. Hey. Sorry, always. This should buy our defenses a bit more time. Forgive me, Kent. I must retreat. I got this. Oh, and there's our level up. Yeah, not bad. Okay, there's that. And then. Oh, I got. No, wait. I'll do what I can. It's worth a shot. I will give it my all. A sign is adjutant. Control. It's time to move. I'll do it. <laughs> <laughs> Nice. Shall we? Sure, deal with I that other succeed. one. So this is what the kingdom can do. You've really risen to the occasion. Good. Why do you think so? Nice. There's little time for idling. Uh, this is all I've got, huh? Okay, yeah, we're gonna sign this set of back to, as an adjutant. Then control. Let's give it a shot. Allow me. All right, let's heal a bit. Come on, Felix. There you go. We've outlasted them. Oh, uh, what? Oh, come on. He's broken free. Catapults appear to be working, though. Come. This is our chance. Dear goddess. Oh, hey. Oh, so we. We will proceed as planned. We must strive to perform to the best of our ability. Let's begin. It's time to move. It's time to move. I'm going. We've got some mages here to help. They're ready to attack the village ruins whenever you say the word. We must support our champion. Advance to his position at once. Oh, come on. Imperial soldiers? Are they trying to heal the Death Knight? Looks like. Now this is where Ash would- No. Ash would be- This is where we need a brawler, and we don't have that. Shall we? Here. You deal with one. 
I've got this. Shall we? Let's give it a shot. And yeah, Felix is still like kicking, that. so because I never reassigned him, so. familiar though. Great cut the tears. Uh, oh, okay. Right, Felix, come back. I'll do what I can. And I want you to be a Mercy's adjutant. I'll back you up. Did you not? That is a deed most foul. One you will pay for with your life. <laughs> you cannot hope to win so bound in flesh. I'm sorry, uh, aren't you also this bound in you flesh? Get out so this I'm sorry, but like you can run all you like. Why do you fight me? Why so this? And here I thought we won. As did I. Who knew the Ashen Demon had that kind of strength? Not that I'm making excuses. You gave me power of my own, and it still wasn't close to enough. That's not true. Of course it is. What am I even up against here? It's like I looked away for one second, and suddenly I was facing someone else entirely. Hmm. That would explain what was troubling me before. That is the unique danger I sensed. Still, you can win this fight. I know you can. And I'll do whatever I can to make it so. We'll claim victory over that monster together. Get into the face, but let's face it, I'm outclassed. Maybe it's time we gave up this obsession and start looking for a different way forward. Besides, Dimitri said they might even be working for the kingdom before long. We can't count on being rivals forever. What a shocking turn of events! You'd seriously consider accepting that fiend as one of your allies? Yep. You make it sound like the worst idea in the world. We have a war to win here, remember? Gotta keep an open mind. 
Ah, I understand now. You've witnessed your adversary's true strength and convinced yourself you cannot win. But trust me, you don't need to worry. You'll get stronger soon, I promise. Look. Oh. Marvel, I know the cutscene shows that I was fighting the Ashen Demon, but Dimitri's really the person who defeated the Ashen Demon twice, like. So maybe don't go relinquishing your prey just yet? After all, I desire nothing more than to see you achieve your goals. Okay. Oh! Mercedes MVP? Oh no, she just followed up. I need to be stronger, faster. Well, you got both of those. I'll use this to protect my friends. I feel my strength building. Had I such room to grow? Yes, you did. I won't let myself stop. Oh, here. we're MVP. Well, we're level 18 now, so. I'm getting stronger. Okay, so we did get that treasure. Great. Nice. Hello, Bernie. We can cheat your level down, but welcome back. A glove does not defy the hand, and yet you've done just that. So this is my name, yet I am also called The Beginning. I am progenitor and mother to all who call Fodlin home. Where am I? I am not here to answer all you ask. But that's just a simple question! Yet I will grant the one. You stand before my throne. If you so wish, then take a seat. But know then that your flesh is mine to wield. You lack the power to resist. My flesh? What are you saying? You should not have interfered! I could have cut that wretch down with a stroke! Oh, that one vexes me so. When next we meet, I must step in and deal with them myself. It is quite clear that you cannot my power safely wield. Do I speak plain? Not in the slightest. I have so many questions. Hey, lazy bones. <laughs> Get up already. Okay, Gerald. You sure you're all right? You don't seem like yourself. I'm fine. Just a strange dream. Like the ones you used to have. Yes. But this time, we talked. Huh? You fool! That was no dream! Ugh. What's wrong? Nothing. Wait, didn't you... Do you lack wits? My voice is not for him. Whenever I speak, it is for you alone. On second thought, I think there is something wrong. I mean, my hair's still a different color, right? Yes, and your eyes, too. How that happened is beyond me. Anyway, we lost the battle, so probably best to wave this place goodbye and find somewhere to rest up. Is that a fact? Actually, I think I'd feel more comfortable staying here on the battlefield a while longer. I just need to swing my sword around, get my head on straight. Don't worry, I'll be fine. If you say so, but if it gets any worse, tell me. Oh! At least you, have, you care somewhat. This isn't an enemy we can beat if we're not at full strength. We're not just up against the kingdom here. They've got the church on their side, too. And the Knights of Saros. Yep, there's that This will thing. be a trying battle indeed, but I will follow you to the ends of the earth if I must, Captain. Oh, oh, Even so in the sad. face of my own former colleagues, I won't pull a single punch. Thanks, Alois. 
I know it won't be easy, but the Empire's shoving a lot of gold in our pockets for this. We've got to deliver on our end of the deal, even if it means taking on the Knights of Seros to do it. You look troubled, Gerald. Is something wrong? Uh, can't hide anything from you, can I? It's just I have history with someone from the church. And I'd rather keep it as history if I can. I don't want anything to do with them, not as enemy or ally. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, that's not gonna. Happen You're really going that. back to Ferdiad? After all it took to get to this point? I will only be gone for a short while. A month at most. Perhaps. Oh! I don't understand. What could possibly demand your presence in the capital so urgently? Is there something big going down in Ferdiad? I can't imagine things have gotten too out of hand with my father there to hold line. Explain to them, Boar. This is a threat only us northerners understand. Very well. A group of soldiers from the Srang region has broken through the defenses in Gautier territory and makes for the capital. According to reports, Duke Yvonne herself rode out to intercept them, but was overwhelmed and subsequently captured. Okay. All contact from Margrave Gautier has ceased as well, so we've no way of confirming any of this. What? This is horrible. You can say that again. There's no chance of mounting a war effort when your capital's been ransacked. To be honest, I can't imagine my old man going down that easy. It's still true that we've lost contact with him, though. Something's definitely happening here. This is quite an alarming revelation indeed. Not only has the church made the northern town of Camulus its new base of operations, but many of our members have been traveling to Ferdiad on a regular basis. Swing. Oh. That's the peninsula north of Farkas, yes? Yeah, but as far as I can remember, they've always been peaceful. Peaceful? Hardly. You show even the slightest hint of weakness, and they'll sink their teeth into you without so much as a second thought. The Serang region borders the northeast side of our kingdom. It's a harsh land, blanketed in snow from the outset of the year to its dying days. So, we're dealing with Strang, and the Alliance had to deal with Elmira. Cool! I can only assume they seek fertile ground. And in Wait. doing so, the means for their survival. Claude didn't suddenly go get Elmira and Strang to join up like he did in Golden Deer, right? Or Gold... Golden Wildfire? What? what? Shame. We could have negotiated had they not been so intent on pillaging. As it stands, I'll be returning to the north to lead a force meant to repel them. With both the Margrave and Duke Yvonne missing in action, the matter is gravely serious. His Majesty has no choice but to get personally involved. If it's really that bad, wouldn't it be better if we tagged along? We'll need backup if the fight's gonna be as tough as you're making it out to be. You cannot deny that, Dimitri. This matter concerns us as well. We would be remiss not to offer our assistance. I appreciate the offer, truly. But we need to maintain a robust force here as well. You're one of the key figures in this army now. Look after Aryan Road for me. You're, you're still give it to, me. to the Empire's forces. But it is only a matter of time until they hit back. To do, Rodrigue, the two of you will ride with me. A few dozen knights will be joining us as well. Yes, your majesty. It's still entirely possible that the Margrave's envoy was somehow delayed. That nothing is in fact amiss. Sylvain, I'd like you to await them here in Orion Road, just in case. Got it. Stay safe out there, your majesty. As for you, Thank Duke Caldarius, I leave command of the army to you in my stead. What? If the envoy does arrive, well... The appropriate course of action will be in your hands. Just remember, the soldiers stationed here are not mere soldiers. They're kingdom citizens. And as such, we have a duty to protect every last one of them. If they're lost, I will have nothing left, save hollow prayers for the dead. <laughs> Fine, then. Oh, boy. Please, don't look at me like that. I know this burden is a heavy one, but I suspect you will lead them better than I. I wonder if there's another word where Dimitri's like, Hey, Felix, take up the throne for me, thanks. I don't want it. Now then, I 
expect you all to keep word of my leaving between ourselves. It would not do to have that information fall into the Empire's hands. Something tells me that's gonna happen. Azure Glean, the King awakens. The Kingdom's assault on the former Arendelle territory proves successful, but the wind carries dire word of invasion from Srang in the north. Having lost contact with Margrave Gautier, I forgot they gave Margrave Gautier like a full capital, character design in this. Yet he marches Along with Lawrence's father. And you're sure? Very. The Srang people did indeed attack, but they never broke through Gautier territory. Meaning the Margrave is unharmed. Why then was our contact cut off? It's possible someone within the kingdom is interfering. The Margrave suspected as much when his initial envoy never returned. In response, he dispatched a slew of messengers, myself included, all on wholly distinct routes. It would appear I'm the only one who arrived safely. It's good to know my father's safe, but it's starting to sound like we have a big problem on our hands. Oh, this is why they're in the darker behind this calling like it now. Not, someone's ambushing these messengers as they pass through Blathed Lands. And this is bringing back bad memories. It's all too similar to when Count Rose's convoy was attacked. The Boar suspected Cornelia at the time, and I'm growing ever more inclined to agree with him. Have you any news from the North? What of the capital and the king? Nothing at the time of my departure. I'm sorry to report. Guess there's only one way to find out then. We should head up there ourselves, Felix. The Margrave would surely send word if something were to happen at the capital. I imagine we'll have more clarity on the situation in a few days' time. Not if uh, no other envoy survive. We don't have a few days. You need to act, Felix. And you need to do it now. Stop pressure and feel it. But if we move too rashly, the Imperial forces near the fortress will grow wise to our maneuvers. As though any of that'll matter if the king winds up dead. Losing Aryan Road would be the least of our worries then. We'd be trapped in a massive war of succession and easy pickings for the Empire. <sighs> Even at a distance, that man has an uncanny talent for giving him headaches. <laughs> Very well. Notify all troops stationed at the fortress and round up a team of our most elite soldiers. We're heading north. Wow. Yeah, I was there. Uh, do, 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 do. Temporary power ways with Dimitri. Temporary power ways with Stu. Temporary power ways with Rodrigue. <laughs> Which means we have no axe units. This is a problem. Actually, hang on. Sure, we'll do their two supports. Mercedes. Good. I need your help. Felix? Why do you have a cat? Picked it up? Yes, I can see that, but... <gasps> oh no! Its little leg is hurt! Here, let me have it. I may be able to heal it with magic. There. It should be fine now. Thanks. Sorry for the trouble. Oh, it's no trouble at all. Though I must admit, you're the last person I expected to bring me an injured kitten. It reminds me of how my little brother once took in a cat when we were young. Hey, that's right. You have a brother from a different father, right? Yes. This was a long time ago, when we both still lived with House Bartels. My brother took in an injured cat, and after it healed, it began living in the mansion. 
We did our best to feed it secretly so it wouldn't be discovered. Secretly? What's the big deal with one little furball? We couldn't let anyone find out no matter what. The people in that house were... horrid. Had they learned of the cat, they would have put it in a sack and tossed it in the river. Eventually, my mother and I left House Bartels and never looked back. Though we left my brother behind. Still, I've always wondered what happened to that poor little cat. Animals are smart enough. If the thing felt threatened, it would have taken off. I suppose you're right. Uh, anyway, now that you've fixed the cat, I should bring it back to where I found it. Are you sure? It's clearly taken a shine to you. Yeah, but I can't keep it. The thing's practically a kitten. What if it has parents that, I don't know, miss it? Yes, I suppose returning it would be best. All right, go. Shoo! Come on, get out of here already. Stop rubbing my legs. What is it? You want food? Well, I don't have any. Ah, oh, that cat really likes him. Animals clearly understand when a kind soul comes to their aid. Mercedes, do something. This cat won't stop following me. I'm sorry, but there isn't anything I can do. You'll have to wait until it feels like going home. Goodness, really? Having a cat like you is a good thing. I'm not sure it is. Well, so long as you're stuck waiting, we may as well get comfortable and have a nice chat. Alright, well that's the end of support. And that's gonna be the end of this episode, so... Right now. Uh, and yeah. I'll see you whenever I can next time. Bye.